Welcome! In this video, we will learn a children's piece by Jean-Baptiste Vecherny. So, this is a very short piece in G major and we play most of the time staccato in both hands. Let's start with the first four measures. So we just play staccato. And always try to play them from the surface, not from the air, not like this. Because so it's it's e it's much easier to play it from the surface. And here we have tonic, dominant, and back to tonic. So here's tension and release. And the last note has a tenuto, so don't play it short shortly. It doesn't have a, a staccato dot. So here, this is measure three, we have and with the right hand, so, and then the second time we have the same structure of, of the same material, but piano. So let's play again first time mezzo forte. same material and then we have again mezzo forte but now we start from the note A so here's the climax of this whole piece we start on with a staccato again so mezzo forte this big crescendo is important so we have here dominant seventh chord goes to D major and then we go back to and then we go back to G major so it's the double dominant that goes back to dominant and here we have on the D this is measure 12, we have forte and fermate, fermata sign. So we hold this note longer than it's written. Again, let's play from measure number nine with upbeat. And here at the end we have diminuendo sign so we become quieter let's play the whole piece one more time So, this was my tutorial on a children's piece by Jean-Baptiste Vecherlin. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much.